Hi, my name is Michelle Stylin, or Estrogen, founder of Moxie Roller Skates, and today I'm gonna to be talking to you about the differences between the Jack 1 and the Jack 2 boot. I'm gonna tell you all about how they look, feel, sound, and function. But let's start with the specs. The Jack 1 and Jack 2 are almost identical, except for one really important thing. In the Jack 2, we've got two extra heat moldable reinforcements that wrap underneath the heel and go up throughout the ankle, which allows for more accessible balancing positions on rails, high impact landings, and much stronger lateral support on your ankles. The Jack 1 and the Jack 2 have the same ankle padding that the Jack 1 originally came out with. There are two different kinds of ankle pads in the Jack 1 and the Jack 2. The first kind of ankle padding is a closed cell foam. Closed cell foam acts kind of like sand. If you put your foot into sand, the foam takes the shape of the foot and it stays that way. So we have a closed cell foam in both of these boots that make it so that the shape of the boot is matching the shape of your foot. There's also the open cell foam, and open cell foam is for cushion and comfort. And the same amount of cushion and comfort is in both the Jack 1 and the Jack 2. Open cell foam reacts with a rebound. So once you put your foot inside of there, the open cell foam moves and it springs back. So you put your foot inside of there, that foam is for cushion and comfort, and as you move your ankle, the foam also moves. And that's pretty much it for the specs. Let's move on to the look. Looking at these, you'll see that the outsole on the Jack 1 remains brown, and the outsole on the new Jack 2 is black to match the black backstay and black carrying loop, while the Jack 1 has a white backstay and a white carrying loop. The lining is exactly the same. The hooks and everything else about this boot is exactly the same, which is why we worked very hard to keep the price almost the same. How does it feel? Well, just to touch, it's much easier to squish the Jack 1 than it is to squish the Jack 2. And that's because of those heat moldable inserts. But the suede is and feels the same. It's made out of all the same materials. It really is just a stiffer boot, the Jack 2. How does it sound? How does it sound? <laughs> the Jack 2 is stiffer. The Jack 1 is quieter. And that's because it's absorbing more sound because it's softer. On a harder boot, the sound is gonna bounce. And functionally, well, the Jack 2 is going to feel stiffer and it's going to require twice the amount of break-in period as the Jack 1 will. The Jack 2 may feel a bit smaller because it's more rigid on your foot, but it will, I promise you, eventually break in after about 15 to 20 hours and it will shape and contour to your foot. So functionally, if you want more flexibility, go with the Jack 1. If you want more stability on ramps and rails and higher impact landings, go with the Jack 2. Do not fear the Jack 2 just because it's stiffer. It does require a longer break-in period, but ease into the discomfort in the beginning. It will eventually break in, just like the Jack 1 will break in. All right, that's about everything I can think of to tell you about the Jack 1 and the Jack 2. But is it? Got any more questions? Please put them down in the comments below and I will be sure to answer each and every single one. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up or hit that notifications bell. Subscribe to our channel because we are always hard at work making these videos so that you can learn and love to learn all about the Moxie Skates.